What is up, my beautiful people? Welcome back to another video with your old pal Machinati. Welcome back to my channel. What is the vibe, my beautiful tribe? Happy Tuesday. So if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do so right now. Support me on this journey that I always say is bigger than me because it is right. Let's tap into this video because God is good. God is good all the time. And I'm going to tap into this video right now because when he gave me this message, I was like, okay, I get you, God. I love you, okay? Don't know what the title is. I write all of my messages out with God, okay? And I don't know what this one is. I actually wrote something at the top, but then somebody told me to scratch it, so I did. Let's tap into this energy, okay? To all the unjust, cruel people out there in the world, okay, our enemies, to the people who are even not our enemies, but they're, they're just living in this world thinking that it's theirs and it's not, okay, to you, to them, God's people don't and will never, never lay down, okay, and be beaten. And this is physically, this is spiritually, this is emotionally, okay, this is mentally nothing. We are no longer, okay, no longer, for a lot of us, no longer, and we will never lay down and be beaten by you in any way, shape, or form, okay? Those days are over to all of our enemies. It's over. It's a wrap. It's done. It's canceled, okay? You're not going to any longer get any more jabs, and we're going to take it. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. And we are not going to fight back with our fists. We're not going to fight back with anger, retaliation, but you will see how we will fight back, okay? You will see that. And we won't even be there. Let's tap into it some more. You won't even be able to, okay, attack us in our sleep. All right? Number one, they need to understand that who they will deal with first. Who will our enemies deal with first? They need to understand that first. Before you even think about doing anything to us spiritually, mentally, physically, whatever it is. You got to understand who you got to who you gotta answer to first. Because before they even come to us, they got to go through God. They got to go through our angels. They got to go through our loving ancestors. They got to, for me and my kids, number one, you got to go through my parents. You got to go through them. You may not see my parents in the flesh because they're in heaven right now, but my dad is a showstopper. My mom is a showstopper. They don't play when it comes to people that they love. So you got to deal with them as well. They got to deal with them as well. And I, let, let's, let me just tap into this, this video. God, angels, loving ancestors, and then us, okay? Before your cold, heartless enemies can even get to you and hurt you in any way, shape, or form, they go through all of those people. They go through all of those spirits. And I want you to know that, let, let me just keep going here, okay? Your enemy had to pass the, your spirit team, our spirit team. Then, then, then they said, okay, you are ready. Handle them. Handle them, my child. Handle them. So our enemies, they don't even know it. But before they can do anything to us, before their energy hit us, before their obstacle that they place in front of us gets to us, they have already been dealt with. And no, God and our people did not slam, slam the hammer down and, 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 you know, create misery for them right there. No, they let them go by. Our enemies were let, they, they, they were allowed to go by to come at us and throw an obstacle in our way. Why? Because we have to be prepared just for the next, okay? We have to feel something, okay, so that we can get strength inside of us to know that we are not going to lay down anymore. So, yes, God says, okay, you may pass, but I'm watching you. So, God has allowed your enemies to pass and do something to you, but he's watching them. God also needed you to learn to be prepared for the next person who's going to be cold, hard, and cruel to you, okay? And then when you're prepared, then when you're prepared, they're going to watch you defeat them by yourselves. And they're going to be watching you, but you're going to defeat your enemies by themselves, but by yourself. You guys know what I'm saying? Woo! God is great. Okay, let's tap into it some more. Um, it's preparing you to kick, beep, okay, for the next time. When, they, when God and your spirit team allow someone to do something to you, understand it's for a reason. Understand that you're going to come out greater than you ever was before. Understand that. I don't condone violence. Don't condone violence. I had one fight in my life, okay? I'm not on this platform to say retaliate, do revenge. Nope. Nope. I'm on here to say yes. If you got to protect yourself in the physical, you do that, okay? But I never wanted to come down to that. And for God's people, mm -mm. all you need is your spirit team. All you need is yourself. All you need to be equipped is God, prayer, strength, faith. That's it, okay? That's it. Let's keep going here. Um, but our enemies don't stop at one jab. Never did. If you're like me, your enemies don't stop at one jab, even if you're quiet and even if you're silent and even if God says, okay, go ahead, let me see what you're going to do, they still come back for more because they don't, don't stop until they get knocked hard, until they get knocked out, knocked, knocked out really, really good, okay? I'm talking about that blow that is going to tear them to shreds spiritually, 
okay? Not necessarily in the flesh, but spiritually. In shreds. Just, you know, you know how the shredder is? When the sh they're shredded, okay? They're, sh oh, God, it's great. Let's, let's talk into it tomorrow. Um, they keep going until we shake their world up with our spirit, okay? Spiritually, plus when we stand up straight in front of their faces, okay? Not in the flesh, but when our spirit stands up, when our spirit stands up, there's nothing they can do. And yet we give them to God. As we speak, because you are, um, you're, you're, when, you're, when you speak authority over your life, when you say to, to your enemies out there energetically, they don't have to be in front of you, but when you speak, it shakes their world. It, and they know it and they feel it. Yeah, but they, they, some keep going because they don't care about their lives. Most of our enemies don't care about their lives. As much as they want to put on the fake flex, like, oh, I got this going on. Oh, they, they don't care about their lives. You don't care about your life, one, when you don't care about God. Do you know what I'm saying? Without God, you are nothing. With God, you are everything. Let's tap into this more. Um, your enemies are being spiritually handled, okay? By you, absolutely by you. And of course, by God and your spirit team, they're being handled. They're being handled. And a lot of your enemies have stepped back. A lot of them will step back, okay? But God is saying, all you got to do, my person, my people, my child, is you step back and allow me to do what I got to do, okay? A lot of us with our enemies, we held on. We wanted our hand to be in their cookie jar. We tried so hard. And a lot of us right now, today, June 27, we let them go. We gave them to God. Do your thing, God. Do your thing. And God is what? Doing his thing with your enemies, okay? And God is saying, you did your thing. You did your thing. You did your thing. Let's tap into this more. I think I'm done. That is it for this video, okay? That is it for this video. God's people, we are not, not going to ever lay down and be beaten in any way, shape, or form. They can take that back to the where they got it. The alley. I don't care where they take where they got it from. They, they can take it back. They can, we are strong. We are not to be played with. And we don't give a beep about whether or not you want to turn someone against us. Because those people that you turned against us, and are in, let me just say this. They turn a lot of people against us with lies. And they need to understand is that we didn't lose anything. I didn't lose anything when you told a lie and somebody believed it. I didn't lose anybody. I didn't lose a friend. I didn't lose anybody. Do you know, like, we didn't lose anything. And I hope that these people out there in the world who try to turn people against people and lie and use slander and all this stuff and gossip, I hope that they understand we don't lose anything. We gain so much more than you will ever know, than you will ever experience and feel in your life, especially if you stand that nasty energy. All right? That is it for this video, my beautiful people. Okay? I love you so much. Stay in this good energy that you are in. God is with you. I'm with you. We are in this together. And no, we are done being beaten in any way, shape, or form. Okay? Not having it. If you feel like you're in a situation right now and you're watching this video and you need to get help from someone, get help right away. Because I know that there's a lot of people who are physically being beaten and and and, and it and I I can't imagine. Okay? So please get help. If you are suffering from any kind of a mental anxiety over 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 bullies and spiritual bullies get help and understand that your strength is is nowhere um it's it's not far from you it's it's next to you it's inside of you okay pull it out pull the bible out go to church get the word of god hang around better people and understand that your life is yours it is not to be controlled by anybody else okay i love you guys so much i'll see you guys in the next video love and like bye